And developing tonight, Hoover High graduate and NFL player Michael, Michael Kendricks is facing serious allegations. He's charged with using insider trading information to rake in more than a million dollars. Kendricks won the Super Bowl earlier this year with the Philadelphia Eagles. CBS 47's Dennis Valera joins us live at Hoover High School where Kendricks played football. Dennis, uh, he has apologized about these charges. Yeah, that's right, Ken and Catherine. The Hoover alum made a statement shortly after these charges were announced, admitting to what he did and promising that he would pay back every cent he earned while doing this. Now, I met one of his old teammates. Here is his reaction. I'm very shocked to hear any of this. Greg Chartier played with Michael Kendricks on Hoover High's varsity football team more than 10 years ago. But for Chartier, Kendricks was more than just a teammate. He was there when my dad passed away in 06, and you know his family helped me get through a big, a lot of my issues with it. So he's a good guy. It's why he's perplexed at this news. The U.S. Attorney's Office in Philadelphia says Kendricks, with the help of Demolary Sanoiki, made 1.2 million from insider trading tips. In return for this inside information regarding the investment bank clients, Mr. Kendricks provided approximately $10,000 in cash and tickets to Philadelphia Eagles games. Kendricks made a statement admitting guilt and apologizing for the charges. Part of it reads, I sincerely apologize to my coaches, the owners, and my teammates on the Eagles and the Browns. I also apologize to my family who I have failed in this. You all deserve better. Just last month, Kendricks and his brother and fellow NFL player, Eric, held a youth football camp in town. Chartier says Kendricks will always be a stand-up guy to him and wishes him the best. I hope he does the same. <laughs> Just keeps being him, you know. I mean, hopefully he doesn't do that stuff again. Now, after first saying he wouldn't be going with them to their game tomorrow in Detroit, the Cleveland Browns in the last half hour have officially announced they have cut Kendricks from their team. Live here at Hoover High in Fresno, Dennis Valera, CBS 47, Eyewitness News.